Yo, yo, what it do? We got energy. We're going to the gym right now. I'm making a video while I drive, I don't recommend it. Um, I'm not going to have a car for very long, though, because when I go to Thailand, I'm going to be biking everywhere, baby. Woo, woo. Uh, yeah, quick little video, though. MC Me TV, true expression of self. I found your passion. I found it. You don't need to keep looking. You don't need to keep watching other YouTube videos and what's your passion and how to find your passion, how to find your purpose. Look, I got your passion for you, all right? Your passion is health. If you make your passion health, it's just the most sustainable thing to do because everything else can come after that anyway. You really can't manifest anything with any passion that you have if you're not healthy. If you wanna be, if your passion is basketball and you wanna become a basketball player, whether it's just a college or whatever, you need to be healthy. So you need to make health your passion more than anything first and then the basketball comes after. Because if you're not healthy, it doesn't matter how good you are at basketball, you're not gonna be able to hit the court if you're not healthy. So there's your passion. Make health your passion. And when you make health your passion, it's it's so infinite too. Like there's so many things you can th you could you could talk about physical health, you could talk about mental health, you could talk about spiritual health, you could talk there's so much into it. So there you go. You got your passion now, you got something to do. And your passion your passion is your purpose and vice versa. And so in life, if, if you make health your passion, then your purpose in life is to be healthy. That's perfect. That's perfect. And like I said, if you find other passions along the way, like music, sports, whatever it may be, you can, you can just do that on top of it. It's just going to be that much better because being healthy is going to make you, you're going to be able to manifest other things that much better because you're healthy. You're going to have the energy for it. So now, now, you, now you got it. You know your passion now. So focus on health, and you can do it every day. You go work out in the morning. Uh, you know, focus on the food you're eating. Focus on the feng shui of your house, keeping it clean. Focus on uh, minimalism. How can you get? How can you have less things? Focus on spiritual health. You can do meditations. You can do, it, it's never ending. So if you're, if you don't know what to do in the day, cause I, I know there's times with me too. I, I'm like, you know, I, I, I don't, I don't know how to make, what video I should make, right? I don't know, I don't know what to do. I'm just like, oh, I'm just gonna lay here in bed and watch other videos. Cause you know, when you don't have a passion, you don't have a purpose, it's hard to just get, it's hard to just do anything and get the ball rolling. Cause you don't even know what to, what to do, right? So if you have health as your focus, it's infinite. You can start by re reading into health. You can read into just just pick one little segment a day. Maybe you want to do anatomy. Uh, maybe you just want to focus on the lymph system. Then you could just study that. And then the next day you can focus on the glands. And the next day you can focus on uh, muscle. And the next day you can focus on bones. And the next day you can do nutrition. It's never ending. So make health your passion. Health is your passion, really. I mean, everybody wants to be healthy, whether whether they uh, believe, you know, everybody wants to be happy, and ha happiness is health. So there you go. Another episode of the books, MC Me TV. Yup, yup. Thanks for watching.
Be grateful feeling good. When you feel good, be grateful for it because you never know when you're going to feel like shit again. And the best way to stay feeling good is be so grateful for that feeling because when you become ungrateful, that's when you start to go, ex that's when you start to dive externally and take drugs or other things like that because you don't feel good so or because you're not grateful for just what you have so be super grateful and you won't see any lack in life man i just finished the gym i mean how good does it feel after a workout like i don't think i've ever worked out like i almost always go into the gym not feeling that good almost always like i hardly ever am like walking into the gym just like super pumped like I mean I, mentally but like physically I almost always feel pretty bad not like bad but like I don't feel you know but every time I finish a good workout man I feel great every single time <sighs> like you're just my breathing too like I, I become so much more conscious of my breathing after I work out and I just feel like I'm taking such bigger breaths after I work out and I've just got all that oxygen flowing and um, I'm coming up to a red light here so I'm about to show you I just went grocery shopping and I got the deal of the freaking day yo for those that for those that know the Lara bar is where it's at yo the Lara bar is where it's at cleanest energy bar you can pretty much buy and um, I got it for $2.79 for that box. $2.79, yo, for five bars. That comes out to, I don't know, like 60 cents a bar. Amazing. It was on clearance because apparently no one likes apple pie flavor. So MCMe will take it. So yeah, just to finish up the video real quick, I'm pumped up. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to download a new video editor man i got things to do my passion is health health is my passion and my purpose um i hope you like the video hey peace out one last little gem for you okay pro health tip of the day these are some plums right some black plums they were a dollar fifty a pound always buy what's in season because what's in season is going to be what is most abundant and what is most abundant is going to be the cheapest. So right now, black plums are in season from the north. Mangoes are in season from the south, right? Mangoes, you can get the biggest mango you want all pretty much for a dollar each. Always buy what's in season. Why? Because when you buy what's in season, you're buying food that's going to be more local. It's going to be the re it's going to be there's so many reasons. It's going to be closer to you and it's going to be cheaper that's the biggest two right there so environmentally it is more friendly to buy what's in season because you're getting food that's closer to you right why buy something why buy like an apple that's out of season when there's mangoes that are in season right or you know that's just an example but because the mangoes are going to be shipped so much closer right if you're getting apples, like right now in Florida, right? Apples is a bad example because they're in season, but let's just pretend they're not in season. If I were to get an apple instead of a pear, I could, or, an, oh man. If I were to get an apple instead of a mango, right? The mangoes are shipped very close, locally, within 50 miles of, of, the, of, of the grocery store. Whereas you buy an apple, it's going to be shipped at least two to three hundred miles if not more if you're living in florida or wherever you're living depending on where you're living so in that shipping process the food is just aging whereas you get a mango that was locally harvested it's probably it was probably shipped you know only 50 miles away and it's fresher it's newer it's it's just it's better in general and it's going to be cheaper so whenever you're buying in season at least regardless of health i mean health is the best but regardless of that it's always going to be the cheapest food the majority of the sales at your grocery stores the reason why there's a sale for them is because there's such an abundance of whatever it may be they're trying to get rid of it they're trying to sell it so right now mangoes are all a dollar each because there's mango it's mango season there's mangoes everywhere but outside of the season right they're going to be getting it from maybe costa rica things like that they're going to be getting it shipped and you're going to pay twice as much so you're going to be paying two dollars a mango plus it's been shipped and picked way too early all right health tip of the day it's kind of a long one 
Hope you enjoyed the video. Said it three times. Another episode in the books. MC Me TV. True expression of self from me to you. Yep. Yep.